Hey, it's the running back again. We are now five days from the end of ranked season one, I believe it is. As you can see, I'm up to rank 14. I very highly doubt I'll make it to Legend before the end of the season. But maybe next season. Who knows? Probably not, as I don't foresee me getting any new cards until after they announce Chris and Max Ramis details. Particularly the pricing, I'd like to stockpile so I can go in as quick as I can, get it, clear it all out. Just uh, dive in head first, make a few videos on that. If I'm lucky, I might actually be able to be one of the first ones making the videos. Well, that'd be great. Alright, against Gul'dan. Your soul shall be mine! Yep, keep me still. Talk not, or Hex not so much. Don't think I'll have anything too big to worry about. That's not it. I do have two of those. But seriously? That is the worst mulligan ever. And yes, it can happen that you can get your extra copy. I've uh, done some research on that. And that's working as intended. Good crap, though, but it's working as intended. Job's done. <laughs> well, that's useless until I play something with a 1-1. Hmm. If I play Mana Tide, it's gonna go down. If I play Flame Tongue, it's gonna go down. No, wait, Flame Tongue's not going down. My bad. There we go. Full health. For the crusade. Yep. Okay. Well, hopefully, I get to talk one. Not quite. Uh, at the top one, this would be sticking around for probably another turn. Unless you, you know, go into the soul fire or something, which would be stupid. Well, uh, not that stupid, but I won't be able to uh, turn it into a red. So. Elements guide me. Well, I'll do it. Fair enough for me to work with. Elements. Didn't matter which way I could get the right field off. Well, two hearts can die no matter what. I'm sure they take the same time. Okay. 
Oh no. Significantly more media than that one, but of course higher cost. I want to play him as soon as I can. He's getting exponentially less good the longer he sits in my hand. So Lost point. No, that's not too terrible, actually. Probably what he was hoping to lose. It's just one of the mana. And that comes off the shield quite nicely. Freeze it, but it will. You could unfreeze it with a silence, which would probably be a waste of silence. <laughs> They're going all out. That's still a little left a minion. Better to you know, help him throw it off and hope for RNG to kill it off. Assuming he doesn't kill my knife. Or... Still has full mana, so he can play all his cards. Are you? But, there's no one else from the other board. It's currently ahead of me in total card advantage by one card. I guess I don't like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is about to hurt. Okay, where's my other lightning storm? Come on, he's got another name. Come on! Play whatever the hell you're hoping to play. Uh, too little mana for it to be a doom card. I think. I think. I believe that's sucky. It could be Reckless Rocketeer, it could be Argent Commander. Probably something. I have no idea why he's... Oh, well, yeah, that'd do it. Oh, Alright, yeah, Are open. And he's 
is out of is going by one card per turn, top decking, as it's kind of referred to. Which, of course, most of you know that. But for those of you who did, there's your card uh, card game message for that. So we are not quite as close as we would seem to be by his Pokemon. He's in a much better place. Now he's in a much worse place. <laughs> and for my other weapon from West. Fantastic. Exactly what I needed right there. Now the tables are turned a bit. He does have the more cards in hand, and of course he's going to keep drawing. So he is keeping hand advantage quite well. Okay, Berserker. Do you need a blessing? And the Young Priestess. Okay. Those are both somewhat problematic when combined. That's not really a A Hellfire would do him very little good. Pushing that would screw his own board. Move as it is. One shot. An archer to pin him away. Yep. That seems. Having that great deck. I'm giving him enough health to survive the hit. Clever. Cards are running out of health. So his hero power is growing exponentially worse. In fact, if he continues to use it, he will guarantee his own loss. Three cards. Better hope. <laughs> yeah, that's what he better hope to do. Yeah, I can neutralize the zero power by playing that. And then I can move him down into the power. Get rid of a minion. Or right, draw a card. Draw a card and see what we get. A lot of nothing, really. I did be able to get my talk to him back. Very nice. Perfect. Rid of uh, one of them. Two, if I can suss out the Wrath of Air totem. Possible. In fact, I believe it's at 50 50. Yes, because there's four air totems here. Twisting Adder would be his best bet. Hellfire would screw him. Because it doesn't just hit minions, it hits all characters, including the minions. Obviously, I can't. Yeah, I can't. Pull both of these. I win. This is a lot complicated. Um, board as you can and hope to hit face and hope I don't get a lightning storm. Alright, up to rank 13. Then 
Strom. I don't need that much stone. <laughs> that means <laughs> he pretty much lost because he did 18 damage to himself. Wow. This goes to show you how much of a double-edged sword a warlock hero, uh, the warlock hero power, really is. Hunter! Definitely gonna need that. Yeah, fairly good hand. Knife juggler. Eh. Most of the classes I'd say no, but this turn four could actually kill something. Turn five. I'd probably be dead if I waited till turn five to play this. Yep. That's certainly interesting. I could play one of them on turn two. I hope it survives and play Feral Spirit on foot. I think that's the best option since I have two in hand. Why not? Why don't you move the coin off of that? What's. Animal Companion? I mean, he got the pig. And the pig went for my face. Granted, I did waste a little bit, but I would have wasted potentially four as opposed to, or actually, to waste two as opposed to just one. And I'm a lot happier about wasting more than two. Yeah, I think. Card draw, I. Uh, again, I've said this before. Huston does not have a grave area. So those two cards, now four cards actually, that got discarded. Yes, it did thin this deck out considerably, look at it compared to mine. But, he's losing four cards. Even not by six. But the cost was four cards in this deck, and I don't know what those four cards were, but they could have been his heavy hitters, his big removal, his whatever. the rather infamous um explosive track. That's gonna wipe my board. So let's trigger it. Yep. Now why did I trigger it? So I can play the rest of my stuff that work. Then yeah, I can get that six damage off, but oh well. Uh, turn six. Then my fire elemental could play Hogger. But he doesn't get any value out of Unleash the Hounds at this point. I think it's a little bit of money. Oh! I don't know what that is. Fantastic! I'm playing my fire element. Getting rid of that hyena. Staying up three minions. Uh, with this deck, it's actually the perfect counter, really, to the Hunter Rush decks with Mr. Hounds, which they all have. Because I don't typically play more than two or three minions until late game. And this is the type of deck that will pretty much burn out uh, before getting into late game. Okay. And it comes the Unleash the Hounds. Stone does four. Oh. Okay. 
I think it's fairly obvious what I uh, will be doing from here. Next to that. Next to that. Look at that. And that. And I can hear the hunter screaming <laughs> in my head. I am one to freaking minions, you asshole! No, I have no reason to. This stuff can get east out of it. That is irritating. That's funny. So, that. And play nothing more. He's got three minions. This would be a good time for him to play on each rounds. Okay. Shut down a high name. Ow! Oh. Is this a new stuff at the bottom of the deck? Or something? That takes care of that. Let's give him two little tokens. Four, so I can only play six cost in each turn. However, I'm killing a minion of his. Two minions. Actually, unless he's got something that'll weaken me, he's not killing this whole fucking board. Not bad. And we go. Okay, that removed the taunt aspect. What else we got? Mukla. Okay, what else we got? Sometimes that's not good. It's gonna be guess no one loose the house. Does this seriously, does this guy not have any times in this deck? Let's hunt it. Damn it. 
I don't know if I want to play it. I'm sick of three words. Oh. This style pisses me off so much because it is pretty much the oh, the net deck. The reason it pisses me off so much is because people do this net decking. Don't even freaking bother to you know, understand the strategies themselves. They just copy what they've seen uh, YouTubers do. Yes, I know I'm on YouTube, but I'm making my own custom decks. I don't net deck. I don't look this crap up. I will borrow strategies and tailor them to my own deck. Yes. But in doing so, I learn new tricks and create new tricks of my own. And net decking in any game just pisses me the hell off. Because it <laughs> it promotes idiots. Now, one can take a net deck and learn it and make it their own. But nine out of ten times, the guys I'm doing, the guys I'm playing that are doing these net decks don't do that. Why? Because they'd have to be creative enough to create their own deck first. I right, know the argument is, oh, they want to get to the right room and rank. Oh, this is the best way to do it. Yada yada yada. And there's some validity in that point, but... Eventually, it's all just going to be everyone playing the same copy and paste decks. Which is nothing more than a pain in the ass. It's a problem. Let's see if that makes sense. Oh, yeah. Damn it. Sorry, sorry, this is what I guess. Plus, I gotta wait without taking that one point ahead. So. Alright, let's see if I can do this. 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 Let's see if I Does that work? No. Because it, it, And that my opponent has brought up an excellent point. Healing as a time in Hearthstone is not activating a healing effect, such as the this, uh, hero power, but by actually restoring health. Since no health was actually restored because my Wrath Fairy to Totem was at full health, uh, there was no change, thus no uh, difference. Again, most you know, damage from server does not call it crap. Got it on weapon. Should have put it on a totem, but what's done is done. I'll go ahead and play this. Not gonna have much use for the coin. There we go. Should have put it on. I'm tired. Had a bit of a day today, so. This is probably where Shadow War of Pain is going to come out and kill my knife, probably. Holy Nova. Interesting. Should I play this? I only have the one of them in this deck. Alright, <laughs> that's no news. Interesting that you can still activate it when your opponent's board is cleared. Uh, well, hell not. It will escape both Shadow of Pain and Shadow of Death. Because it's got 4 attack, not 3, not 5. Nor anything above or below those two. Below the first, above the second. And doing nothing else. Interesting. Oh, well, 
not that hard, but again, four attack. That's out the range of the Shadow Ward cards. Not at 10 mana yet, so Mind Control's not gonna do anything to it. Mind Control tech could take control of one of my minions. That could be against the annoying. Taunt, okay. Power shield, followed by double health, followed by make attack. Yep. Or by the delicious sweet tears of a priest. Never buff your minions out that high. And unless you've got it ready to attack. Because then it'll get hexed or polymorphed or insta removed. And every class does have an instant removal, you just gotta be clever about it. Warriors, you've got to. Okay, now goes everything for Hogger. Oh, and my man of course. There goes my man as I was saying with warriors, you've got to hit it with something, go for the whirlwind, and then execute. And that's an scaring over for them. Rogues have assassinate, and of course have a polymorph. Druids have naturalized, not commonly used, I'm aware of that. Well, maybe not aware of it anymore. I, it wasn't commonly used, I believe. It has found some of these. <clears throat> Lately, in certain again net decks for druids, but um, I'm sure it's quite used as much, but still. Ah, clever! That's a way for a priest to use instant removal on anything. Very clever. In fact, you know what? Well, well played. What yeah, it was indeed well played. doesn't have any real instant removal. Uh, aside from the war. Um, Paladins. Well, not so much. They, of course, have the equality pyromancer combo. Or equality. Um, consecration. That's what it is. Got one hell of a tall man. For him, there is by no means a way that he can uh, stay off.
That's the end of that. considerably more damage. Uh, <laughs> more damage than he started off with because priests they heal. Go figure. Got earlier move up the wazoo. Leopard gnomes beware. Golden hero. Did not notice that before. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> There's always that one frickin' boomerang. I love how they did that little hip hop thing up golden. It's in the little border. Oh, that's very nice of them. It's not the gaudy stuff some people thought it might be. Oh, that, that is beautiful. Blades and. Oh, that's all so cute. Let alone for now. I'd be giving him card advantage if I tried to get rid of it. I actually have to use up three cards in my hand. They're about to run it down. That's been changed to where it, uh, it works on the head of the turn the end. Again, that's the exact result I was hoping for. Let's see. I have a hand advantage of one, field advantage of one. advantage of two. Give me a card advantage of one. I have the plus one. Plus two. Plus three. Plus two. Ha, this guy's dead. Plus zero. Brotherhood shall fail. Oh, very well played. Whatever will I do? Again. Don't put big crap until you've got a way to protect it. Or make sure you actually get value out of it or something. I love the wolves, they are automatic plus one in the, in the air play. 
does one card to me. Uh, six, seven, as opposed to my ten. I am to taste the mana. Inferior to the Mage's Mana Worm. Because, yes, it does get one more attack than the Worm does, but it only sticks around for. Uh, the bonus attack on sticks around for that one. Alright, since it's that one, I should have played the totem power first to, to get the spell power so I could have wiped it all out. But worst mistakes have been made being smart, not smacking into this for damage that's immediately going to be good back up. Smart. There's that Ralph Air totem. 10 15 damage on the next turn. Not enough to kill. I am a stretch of the imagination. Spend mana, I guess. Getting fairly decent stockpile with gold going. Again, I have no clue how much Chris from Max Ramus is going to cost. Some people are going to say, oh, it'll be like 200 gold. Some are saying, oh, it's going to be 2,000. We'll see. I hope it's not 2,000. That'd suck. I'm betting it's going to be somewhere between 2 to probably 400 gold. Wing. You know, except uh, the free first one. Another hunter net decker. No, I should be keep, I should give you the benefit of the doubt, but I'd be a fool if I did. No. Maybe get one card out of that. I don't think I'm gonna make it turn six without any other taunts. It is the net, the net deck is effective. Just
and encourages, oh, let's see who can win first instead of, oh, let's see who can win better. And by that I mean who can build the better deck, not more exactly copy of the better net deck. And with this, when it only draws you one card before getting removed, it does pay for itself. It gets you that one card. See? Made for itself. Actually, if you're out one card to remove. So it's a little actually a little bit better than simply paying for itself. Because it didn't give me a plus one by making me draw more than one card. But my opponent used up one card getting rid of it. So again, still not well. Depending on how the math goes, it could be a uh, plus zero to me, minus one to him. Stampy Nakoto. Unleash the hounds. Interesting. Sorry, Helena. Timberwolf. And also renew my mana for the next turn. There we go. useless. I say almost because I do have a few tricks I can give it some trading use. Perfect. goes wrong. No, I said that to me. Well, I guess if I don't see a hand. You know, I'm killing at least one. Okay, I'm killing the minions, no matter what. Well, hopefully I can kill one of these two. Perfectly. Yes, that's exactly what I want to kill. And that's a bit of a waste of damage, but whatever. It's really overloaded. And there's that tracking. And I'm down to 15 cards. And, and, and Hearthstone, I don't like that type of cards. I love it in other games. Yu-Gi-Oh! Magic the Gathering, those are awesome for me, because those are the styles I play. Stuff where I'm getting cards from the grave, cards from the banish, cards from whatever. Hearthstone don't have that mechanic. And as I've said before, it saddens me that the Hearthstone does not have it, because there are many fun and interesting strategies that could evolve from that, and would add a level of depth to it. The likes of which this game needs. 
this was all damn ten pounds. <clears throat> oh, Jesus, sorry. Yeah, it ain't good. That's not another one of those pants. Because if it is, I just put them on grave. And then for Grizzly. And then we'll go to New York. Yeah. I think that I got some my way out of this. Golden card, and that's probably going to go into my deck. <sighs> so we're getting back into the net deck hunters, great. Guess it is time to bring back the mage. Get the rock fighter. Actually, there is a bit of a variant I could do with this that would assist against hunters. I gotta figure out the codes for it. I'm so loath to take out the, the farce here, but... Uh, Cult Master I'm having a hard time getting value out of, so let's do it that way. Okay, both of those, both golden. So Drake, card draw and spell damage is nice. I prefer the guess it's an auctioneer for that, for the card draw though of spell power. I don't exactly rely on it. And do I have the... Yep. I only got the one. Alright. Oh, there's actually a better menu for this. Yeah. Better being a relative term. I'm the Blade Master, Zacchaeus. See, I don't have much in the way of uh, heavy hitting meat from uh, 7 plus stuff. I got a fair bit in the 6 range, but nothing's really worth mentioning. No, no, no bloodlust. Alright. 
I'm gonna give this my last run real quick. See if I haven't fixed it up so hunters will fear the shaman. If not, back to me as it is. days I'm gonna do a deck where every mini neither has taunt or gives it. Gina. Obviously there's gonna be a couple of them that have taunt themselves. Otherwise the gift taunt thing is gonna be useless but that's the general idea. Mage. Had to be a mage. Typically mages don't really care about taunt, they will ignore it. That is a fantastic turn too. Especially um it's a magic kick to not useless. Oh never mind. Don't want to play. That is a very pretty rock fighter weapon. And that is a very plain, and not very <laughs> much better weapon. Elements guide you. Okay. So, he's gonna ping that. He's gonna be an idiot and not ping that. No value for you. Okay. Challenge. Maybe a rock fighter will handle that situation well. Eh. Let's use one out of the place. I was doing a dumb train for both of us, kind of. Cards, that's perfect for the hex if it gets built up. Put the devil on your head. Let us see what mischief we can make. Oh, anyway, I do love that animation. They did not have that in the beta. I know, I tested. Granted, it was like one of the last. Uh, key giveaways. No, there were, there were a few others, but it was one of the ones before the open data. What else do you have? Otherwise, I'm just gonna go to town. Can't buy the paint. We are going to get rid of that first. Crap. Good, I almost made it work. Again, because I wasn't thinking. Kinda made one anyway, didn't I? Nuts. Now let's put it back to full health.
reason we're doing that is it's not going to get pinned off by a fireball it does more unfortunately have to haunt now. Do that, but cost him many, many classes, which is fine for me. Okay. That brings us a wet problem. And this gets us to a much safer point. Just for me again. Quick come in handy. Finish something off that he's already damaged, or to kill a sheep. Let the pain speak to me. Hoping his own acolyte of pain. Not bad, not bad at all. Looks like you come down. If not, he's out of the I was gonna say incredibly, I'm like you're incredibly stupid. I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt and say incredibly unlucky. That's it for tonight. See you next time, and maybe next time we'll get up to, hey, rank 10, why not? Good night!